Hello and welcome to this hourly news update. In breaking news this hour, we're receiving reports of a serious road accident involving a bus and a chemical tanker. This incident happened at around 8.45 this morning on the busy highway near the airport. Eyewitnesses say that many people have been injured, although the exact number of casualties is not yet known. Our reporter is at the scene and on the line now. Um, thank you. Yes, I'm looking at the crash site now. And from uh, what I can see, it appears that a bus and some kind of uh, chemical tanker have collided. It looks as though both vehicles are on their side and quite damaged. Uh, police are keeping people away from the immediate area. But from where I'm standing, I can see that there are many ambulances at the scene. And it looks like the fire service are uh, working to free trapped people in the wreckage. One rescue worker has told me that there are many people injured and that the bus was full of passengers at the time of the collision. They also confirmed that there were several children among those who've been hurt. It is not yet clear whether the injured are limited to those in the two vehicles or whether there are also casualties among the pedestrians who were traveling to work at what would have been a very busy time on the roads. Are you able to tell us anything about the cause of the accident and what the tanker was carrying? I have no information yet about the cause of the accident or what the tanker was carrying, but there is a very strong smell of chlorine in the air, which makes breathing quite difficult. In fact, I can see a lot of people walking around coughing and with watery eyes, and some people trying to cover their mouths to try and avoid breathing in the fumes. I can also see people walking around covered in blood. A crowd has developed here near me, uh, close to the scene, with some people trying to get through to the vehicles to offer assistance. Others are simply worried about whether their friends or family have been caught up in this terrible accident. Do you have any information about how this accident is affecting the local area? Uh, yes, I can also confirm that officials have closed the roads to the airport. So for those uh, people hoping to fly today, it might pay to check with your airline before coming to the airport. Uh, back to you in the studio. We'll continue to bring you updates on this story as we receive them. Now, in other news, scientists say that the latest...